Christmas, as we understand it today, was really never made for queer people. In the Christmas play at school, at the holiday party with our plus one, as a face on the family Christmas card, and the silence at the kitchen table, and certainly in the pews on Christmas Eve, we have never really fit in. We look different, we act different, we see different, we speak different, we love different, and even believe different. And the Picture Perfect Christmas tells a story that does not include characters like us. We all know the experience of exclusion during the holidays, of being the missing person at the family dinner table that glows with candlelight, warm food, and a circle of support, the missing child, the sibling or parent about whom no one will ask, where are they? We know the feeling of being the one they say didn't turn out right, nature's genetic blunder, God's mistake, the one about whom church friends still whisper at that once a year Christmas Eve service when we perhaps take a risk and venture home, wondering if this time the table will be set with us in mind. What's ironic about all of this is that true Christmas, the true Christmas of Mary and Jesus, is where queer people like us can find our home. The meaning of Christmas centers on the plight of an outsider among outsiders, Mary, a racial minority considered the property of a man dwelling in poverty without the benefits of class and the right kind of religion. Even within her own religion, she's disgraced. She's a pregnant, unmarried girl, out of sync with what's normal, what's acceptable, not the picture-perfect Christmas so often depicted. But it's with Mary that God makes a home. Within the delicate and tender womb of the outsider of outsiders, God dwells in Mary as a co-creator of all good things. God's home is in this refugee girl of ill repute about whom the church people whisper. But above those whispers, God says, here is Christmas. Here is Christmas. If you are queer or trans, remember where God made a home of justice, in the womb of that girl, and know that God dwells with you. There is justice in the womb. I hope you are hearing along with me on this day above all else. Here is Christmas. I am with you.